Hope you're all staying healthy and safe. Thank you all so very much for supporting my channel. If you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel. I'm using an online version of Excel today to show how to dynamically create a numbering uh, for a list of places. You can use this uh, steps, these steps to uh, create numbering list uh, for uh, the needs that suit you best. Um, also, this uh, these steps can be used in uh, 365 version of Excel. Here I have list of places listed here for uh, places: Australia, New Zealand, Brazil, and Canada. So if I want to number these, what I can do is put in number one, and then either drag this and create this number one through four list or uh, we can also use a sequence function number and sequence and then we have four here so I'll just type in four and hit enter so I have number one through four here however if I add another country here France cell a6 does not automatically increase to number five in order for us to do so what we'll need to do is use count a function within sequence function so I have here count a and then open races I'll select a range uh, so, for example, I'll select a range that is all the way up to 11, B11, which will give me around 10 countries. I'll hit enter. Here you go. Number 1 through 5. So, now, if I put uh, South Africa here automatically adds number six here um, let's put um, Kenya and then Chile let's put Panama let's add Uruguay let's add Argentina so when I put Argentina at Argentina on my list here, uh, it didn't automatically add number 11 here because our formula has uh, count A all the way up to B11. So if you want to increase this, you can uh, increase it to B12 and then it automatically adds number 11. So if you want to add a um, few more countries, you can always change the list to increase the list um, or the range of uh, count A. So if you add, uh, for example, Bangladesh here, here, India, Nepal, and then uh, Maldives. So when I added Maldives, it didn't go up. So you can again increase the list to 16, B16, which adds number 15 here. So that's how you can dynamically um, create a numbering list. Um, hope this video helps you all. Uh, thank you all so very much for supporting my channel. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, again, please uh, consider subscribing to my channel. And also, if this video helped you, uh, please uh, uh, consider giving it a thumbs up. Thank you all so very much. Y'all have a good day. Bye-bye.